Peggy 16. Hi, I'm Ben Ross, gameplay producer for NHL 13. Today we're going to talk about the pros and cons of speed versus control. In hockey, you were constantly forced to choose between speed and control. In NHL 12, you didn't have to manage your speed. There was no respect for the laws of physics, and you were able to turn on a dime at full speed. In NHL 13, skating is physics-based. When the forward comes in with speed, he has a harder time turning. When he comes in with control, going into a glide first, he's able to make a much tighter turn. The same principle applies while shooting or passing. If players shoot while still at top speed, their accuracy is reduced. If a player is in a controlled state before shooting, they have a better chance of hitting their target. In NHL 07, we introduced the skill stick, which gave you complete control of your player's hands. Now, in NHL 13, True Performance Skating delivers that same level of control over your skates, finally giving you that complete tool set of an NHL hockey player. With this level of control, we look forward to seeing the plays you create.